HIDAR stands for Heat Assisted Detection and Ranging. In this research, we've tried to ask the question, can machines see through pitch darkness like broad daylight? Human perception has an evolutionary bias towards the daytime. As soon as the sun goes down, it is really difficult for us to discern the difference between the building, the trees, the plant, the pavement and the road. Now, can machines perceive the environment, even in pitch darkness, like the sun was shining? Thermal imaging is a special technology that helps us see the invisible. Every object around us, living or not living, gives off a tiny amount of heat. This heat comes out as infrared radiation, something that our eyes cannot see, but the thermal camera can. A thermal camera captures this energy and changes it into an electronic signal. There is a critical challenge in thermal imaging, which is a ghosting effect. If you use a thermal camera to take a photo of a human body, you can barely see the details by the contour like a ghost. So with this lots of information of thermal images, um, it's very difficult to use them for object detection and the ranging. Our work of HEDA is done in this context. Uh, we use our computational approach uh, with the help of spectral resolution and machine learning to successfully reconstruct the texture uh, of the target and also we this uh, disentangle the temperature of the target and uh, uh, with the uh, material and safety of the target. Now we have three physics quantities, uh, which is the temperature T, material and safety E, and the texture X. Showing this T, E, and X information together in the HSV color space uh, forms the text value. Hadar's AI model is known as TextNet. It is a deep neural network designed for performing inverse text decomposition. So, given a hyperspectral cube of data, TextNet decomposes it into three maps, a temperature map, an emissivity map for materials in a material library, and thermal lighting factors. TextNet is trained with a physics-based data reconstruction loss and also with direct supervision if the ground truth TEX decomposition is available. The main challenge in this research was the limited availability of high quality training data. However, the physics based loss function enabled us to compensate for limited data and learn a very effective text net. Similar to radar, which exploits microwave radiation, or LIDAR, which relies on laser pulses, or sonar, which exploits acoustic waves, we believe that HADAR, which uses heat radiation, will have similar transformative societal impact. 